I mean, the guys I looked up to in motocross were pro. So I always considered like being pro on the tour. It took a really long time for me before it clicked. And I was about to give up and then I got it. That definitely gave me a big confidence boost. Pretty good, man. We'll put you on the team. Really? Oh yeah, we'll put you on the C team. We always looked in the pits like, dude, look at that factory bike, you know, like, yeah. and we couldn't get in the pits, you know. I was still like nine or ten years old, so I, I didn't really know much, you know. And I was the little annoying kid in the shop asking a million questions. What's the best board? Oh, how do you do this trick? Oh, how do you do that? Oh, cool. Can I see that? Can I see that? And not buy anything. For a long time, I really didn't realize that being a professional skier was an option. I just wanted to, wanted to surf and it looked fun and it seemed rad. Once I realized, you know, you could become professional, you know, that's what I set my eyes on. From there they put me in like little ski lessons and stuff. I'm like, oh my god, I'm making progress. That was my first milestone, my first type of like shark smells a drop of blood and water like, okay. Yeah, I think I, I, think I could do it. And that was it. As far as I was concerned, that was going to be my career. I mean, it was a long ways away. Someone asked me the other day, what do you do for work? And I'm like, I surf. 